ladies and gentlemen, it is early as can be. The sun is just coming up right now as I speak, and we are heading to some flip sites. We're gonna flip some boards and trash, and uh, I'm hoping we get lucky. We're trying to target king snakes today, and maybe some hognose snakes later. I'll let you guys know how we do. Here, help me. Don't break it if you can. Oh, the oh don't don't grab it by the tail. Don't grab it on the end. Grab it on the front half. Don't let it slip through. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, like... its tail. Yeah. Dude, when I picked that up, that felt like nothing I've ever felt before. <laughs> wow. Yo. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. I really don't want to. I've never seen one before. I'm really just trying not to. I know. I know they just drop off like it's nothing. Yeah, they'll like shatter to pieces. All right, so we found an eastern glass lizard under a board. And that is insane. It looks like a snake, which obviously I'm sure, you know, some of you have heard of before, but I mean, I, I've never gotten a handle on one of these things, but uh, let's get a better look at them. You can see when you look at the face that it actually is a lizard. So eastern glass lizard, eh? I presume. First board of the day. Something's moving. All right, awesome. I've never got a hand on one of these things, and so far we're successful with the tail not coming off by really making sure to grab or only put pressure on the upper portion of the body, the upper three quarters. Um, I know these guys drop their tails like as if they are made of glass, which is <laughs> why they're called glass lizards. So while we are winning and not hurting this guy, I think that's a good time to let him go. Sweet. True. All right, Alex Yay. the green snake man just spotted this rough green basking from pretty far away. I'm impressed. And That's a big one. This is a big one, yeah. Look at that. Jeez. There you go. That's pretty sweet. Like a really, really strong ammonium. Yeah, I kind of agree about that. They do not smell good. Oh, he's gaping. Oh, I've never seen them do that actually. That's awesome. That's really cool. All right, so neat little guy. It's a good way to start the day. Happy to uh, have two nice reptiles at one flip site like that. Pretty cool. We're just gonna put them back into these briars here and they will disappear as they like to do. See, let's go of me. And then invisibility. You'd be walking by and you'd hardly know that it's right there. Cool. All right, so uh, flipping didn't amount to much this morning. Uh, it was cool what we found, but we were hoping for a little bit more. So now we're hiking some nice sandy habitat and uh, we're hoping we can get lucky on a hognose snake. So, we'll see. Ooh, first snake here. Oh, <laughs> he wants some. Uh, is he doing the angry panther of this pose? Oh, oh, give me a little kiss. Nice black rat snake here. I'm gonna get a better grip on him so I don't let him whip around. All right, so cool find here. Nice spot by Alex crossing the uh, little opening that we're walking. Nice, pretty. Black rat snake, nice and shiny, and just good looking snake. Pretty sweet. All 
Alright, good looking snake. We're just gonna let him go on his way here. Keep doing what he was doing. We're gonna keep hiking. Alright, check this guy out. Box turtle. Always like seeing these guys. Let's check him out. We got a runner. Hey, buddy. Look at that mosquito on the turtle. Sucking blood straight through its shell. It's pretty remarkable. Beautiful little box turtle. Looks like it was in the process of trying to get some earthworms or maybe a mushroom or something like that. So I'll leave it to it and keep hiking. All right, so uh, it's a couple nights after we got back from North Carolina or down south, and uh, we're taking advantage of a really wet night. I'm with Alex again, and we are seeing if any salamanders are crossing the road or just hiking around in the woods. We're gonna see if we can find any. Um, we are hoping for marbled salamanders as the primary target, but we'll see what happens. I'll let you guys know. What it ain't a marble spotted? Salamander. Oh, that's funny. There's two spotted salamanders. No marbles. That's dumb. I know. I was trying to feed them worms, but they wouldn't eat them. Okay. All right, we're gonna move them off the road. Salamander is a little metamorph, as in newly transformed, tiny little spotted salamander. That's kind of neat. Whoa! Look it's at this red back. Red. He's this got red back has a cross on its head, and he's got a red back over here. It's religious. The humble red back. That's pretty neat. We're gonna help these guys off the road. Like it's it's double black. Oh, look at this. Hello. And hello to you. That's neat. All right, here's a little four-toed salamander we cruised. Look at that. These guys are actually pretty rare in the Poconos, so kind of neat to see. And they've got nice bellies with white on them, but I'm gonna give this guy a poke on the tail. And come on. We're trying to get him off the road. All right, finally, it took a while, but we got our first marbled salamander right here, and it is stunning. Look at that beautiful male moving across the road here. So check that out. That is a beautiful marbled salamander. Stunning male, really nice white colors, and look at that head. That patterning is just gorgeous. One of my favorite species of salamanders, I always enjoy seeing these guys. And wow, so cool. All right, pretty neat. This guy posed up real well for photos. You can see he's just a real nice individual. I love that back of the head right there. But uh, I'm gonna move this guy off this log. We are taking pictures of him on right here into the woods and we're gonna keep cruising around. All right, we got another one. Look, this one's bigger, for sure. 
We need to go check this spot up here. Beautiful salamander. And we think we might have another one up the road here. Guys. <laughs> now lift up your head, don't be, don't be a baby. Look at all the white on this one's face. That's awesome. All right, pretty sweet. We got two nice marbled salamanders right here. In addition to the, whoa, they're jumping. We'll let them go off the road, but in addition to that one we saw back there, so uh, looks like we got a good section of road here. Seems like we found a good stretch of road. Look at this guy. Come on, buddy. Woo! <laughs> buddy. He runs all the way home. Woo! -hoo. All right, come on, you're almost there. Come on. <laughs> All right, cool. Big old toad. You're in his old. <laughs> no, he's... <laughs> All right, buddy, why don't you stay off the road? Come on. All right, you do your thing, buddy. <laughs> I like that one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Look at that. Oh. Goodbye, buddy. <laughs> I don't even know. It's Around be like number eight or something. Yeah, you gotta be like below ten, but we're nearing ten. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Relax. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> it's like they act like lizards at night. It's so yeah. funny. Like, when have you ever seen a salamander during the day? I guess streamside salamanders, as in stream dwelling salamanders, act like that. But marbles during the day are never like that. Now they're like super active. And Beautiful. It almost looks like that one we found. It's got that same mark on the head. Ah, there you go, buddy. Quite similar. Here's a good change of pace. Pretty choice looking slimy salamander. Look at that. Look at all those spots. That's pretty magnificent. Wow. Another, whoa, that's kind of big. Look at that. Hey, buddy. Big old spotted salamander. See lots of these guys in the winter time. Look at that. First, oh, don't want to drop them from the pie. I don't know why spotteds are moving on this one section in September, but not complaining. So this one's got a cool pattern on the back of the head. Yeah, this one's cool looking. Lots of white. There we go. Keep chugging, buddy. Hmm. All right, so uh, just on our way to actually shine for these guys. But we were lucky enough to cruise one. Nice red salamander. Pretty neat. I might take some pictures of this guy real quick. It's a nice orange one, as they usually are, but sometimes they dull out.
That's sick. That is cool. All right, time to see this guy off the road. But a nice way to end the night, a nice little surprise. Let's make sure he gets off. That's neat, though. Pleasant species to encounter. Bye, buddy. All right, guys. Uh, so it got pretty late, and we decided to head in. If you made it this far, thanks for watching the video. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. And I will catch you guys on the next one.